What's up you guys? Welcome back to another episode of Life of Lauren. This weekend we have a vlog and it's gonna include two photo shoots with a three month old. So we're gonna see how that goes right now. We are headed to like a mommy and me Christmas themed photo shoot which I'm so excited about. This will be like the real tester to see how he's gonna do tomorrow for our family photos. Um, but yeah, we just have like a few festive things we're gonna do this weekend. So I thought I'd bring you along with me, let's get started. Is this shirt sure? okay? Yeah, you can see it. I'm gonna take just a practice one really quick to get a picture. <laughs> He's watching me. Oh He's my watching me again. <gasps> you ready? <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> this little face. Hi. Stop it right now. Is he doing it? Yes, he's doing it. So you saw the behind the scenes. He was a smiley guy. He killed it. He killed it, okay? I was like a background character and he was the main person of the photo shoot. But maybe because he's used to being on YouTube, maybe he just has the touch. He either really liked the girl making him laugh or I don't know. He was in a really good mood. So let's hope that our family pictures tomorrow are the same way. So I did go ahead and invite myself over from breakfast at my mom's even though she wasn't making breakfast. <laughs> and now I am. And I requested blueberry pancakes because those are my favorite. Also, one thing about my family, we don't like big pancakes. We like the little, if you see my hand, we like the little mini ones. So yeah. We can dip them. We dip them in our syrup. We don't put our syrup over them. So this is the right way to eat a pancake. So, pancake, rip it, take your syrup, dip it. <laughs> Didn't mean for that to rhyme. Mm. Tastes better this way. When I got home, I ended up taking a nap. We all took a nap. And now we're gonna eat some Mexican food at Si Senor. event. First we're getting coffee and fed Elijah and now we're ready to go see the lights.
Sunday and I'm in a mad scramble to get myself ready for church, to get Elijah ready for church. So that's what we're doing. Our church is having like a, like this annual Christmas event they usually have. And so I'll record a little bit of that. But today we also have our pictures. As for last night, we got home and the boys fell asleep on the couch. So I was like, this is my moment to watch TV. So I played the elf, I actually ended up editing yesterday's filming. I already edited edited all of that last night, um, but that didn't feel like work. I, I enjoy doing that, so it was, it was nice. Now, yeah, gonna get this little boy ready and then we'll be hopefully on time today, hopefully. Do you see mommy? Do you see, are you so excited to see mommy? Oh, hi, baby. Good morning. You're watching some dancing crew. Okay, he doesn't really watch TV unless it's sports or UFC. But if I have to get ready, it's always gonna be this show, Dancing Fruit. Like, this thing is awesome. Right? Isn't it the best? That's the best show. Yes. Yes. Celebration is a discipline. It is not something. get behind the scenes of our second photo shoot not only was it quick but I also forgot my camera because we were in a rush trying to coordinate outfits and and that whole bit so now I'm back home um, I really made it clean because this place is a disaster and I have a few things I want to unbox to show you because we're gonna be flying with Elijah for the first time at the end of this month so it's just an hour flight it's to Dallas and watch a Cowboys game. He's gonna stay with his aunt in Dallas, but um, I wanna show you what I bought for traveling. So yeah, let's do some unboxing. Okay, box number one, I think it's a cooler. First of all, sorry, this lighting is tragic, but it's already nighttime and yeah, we don't have that nice morning sun lighting, but let's unbox this, I'm excited for it. It wasn't my cooler. It was actually this travel bag for Elijah. They're way, way smaller than I thought they would be. Travel size um, body wash, shampoo, and lotion. Sounds crazy, but when you're traveling, because we've gotten a lot of places with him already, it feels like, and we're gonna probably leave the country in January <laughs> for a little bit. Um, we might go to a resort. If it all works out, we're still working on his passport, but it's just nice to have like his travel section so when I am packing the million things I need, I don't forget the essentials and I know like if I have his travel bag and his travel items, I can just put those in there and a bunch of stuff is already covered. So he already had one with items in it, um, but this was a set so I purchased it on Amazon for like $15. But the next thing, let me explain this. this maybe this should be a whole other episode one of these days is how to travel with the baby. Once I figure it out, cause this is like trial and error. So the Uppa Baby um, stroller and car seat that I have, they also sell travel bags. And why is that important? So I've done like research on how to travel with the baby cause I'm nervous and I like to be prepared. And they talk about trying, find these travel bags. So just like a big bag, you put your stroller in and then a separate one you put your car seat in. And it was expensive, seriously, like 150 for the stroller bag, maybe 130, and then like 70 bucks for the car seat one. So it's like, why would you get those? Okay, let me explain the madness. So for me, that's almost what, 250 almost. I'm not gonna do the math right now. Something like that total. But if you register these on the on the website, this bag and the other bag. And if anything happens to the car seats, scratches, broken pieces, because you have to put them under the plane with all the luggage. If Because people complained a lot about their car seats and strollers getting beat up. If that happens to you while they're in these bags, they'll cover um, the fee for any damage. So to me, that's so worth it. I spent a lot of money on, not me, they were gifts, but 
people put their hard-earned money into buying these really good quality items for us so i really want to protect them get that warranty and we're planning on traveling a lot more with him maybe twice on a flight in the next two months so that's why i got these so this is what the cover looks like for the car seat same concept for the stroller i also got a sweater i'll show you the sweater it looks kind of funky in the bag this is the sweater. It's like a green. Hmm. Nothing special. It's giving, it's giving old lady, but it's giving good quality. <laughs> I'm not sure about this. Should I try it on? I, I kind of, my mom would kill me. She's always like, clean stuff before you try it on. Comment below if I should return this. <laughs> it's alright. It's all, it's like for chilling. Alright, you guys, that's a wrap on this week's episode. It was kind of everywhere, but that's life with a baby. So we had some family photos, some mommy and me photos, a bunch of fun festive things. Stay tuned because we have a lot of fun new episodes coming up. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, comment if you have any traveling tips for a baby because that's like the mode I'm in right now is planning for that and we will see you on the next video.